Hey, what's up, guys? This is going to be a quick little rune and talent guide for if you're running Fire Destro. Fire Destro is the Omega Pumper right now. It is etching out ahead of the Affliction Haunt build a little bit. And once you guys start getting more of the spell power gear out of the raid, it just gets even further. I know it was kind of rough at first when we all went there in greens. Even when I was in there in the green stam in gear, I was tapping all the time. It was miserable. But it's starting to get better now that you have the raid gear. So for runes, I start with Incinerate. Obviously, you need Incinerate and Chaos Bolt. I'm not going to go over the other runes. Those They go hand in hand, right? Keep Emily on the target. Spam Incinerate. Starting with runes, obviously you need incinerate. This is your bread and butter. You're opening with it to get your 25% uh, fire damage. And then you're just putting an emulate on the target and you're going to spam chaos bolt on cooldown every 12 seconds or whatever it is. And don't ever forget this. It does so much damage. Just always keep it up. As for your chest rune, we have some options here. Okay. So Lake of Fire is our highest DPS. This is insane damage. The problem is it's almost impossible to keep this down full time because it's like 20, 25% of your mana. So while this is the best thing in the world, you can't afford it. Um, if you find, a, if you're doing a boss fight where you feel like your mana is fine, then yeah. And you can afford to put that down every 15 seconds, but it really, really hurts right now. Besides the turtle boss, Gamuru, I don't see, a, I can't see a, a way that you can keep this up for a steady two or three minutes right now with our mana pool later down in the game in the later phases, this is going to be amazing and I cannot wait. So that leaves demonic tactics or master channeler. And I'll tell you right now, completely subjective, whatever one you want. Uh, I go demonic tactics and just take a gamble with that 10% spell crit on myself and my pet. A lot of people like to choose Master Channeler just because it still does insane damage right now. So this and a steady healing. You are tapping quite a bit with this build. So if you use Master Channeler, it gives you some more health that's constantly out there because you have the beam up and it does decent damage and you're able to tap more and more. This is completely up to you. I feel like Master Channeler is a little bit better when you're early on in there. And as you get more of the raid gear, I like Demonic Tactics a little bit better. As for the talents, it's pretty straightforward. Five in a Cataclysm. This is not an amazing talent, but it's better than ISB, and some mana return is better than none. And then, of course, take Bane, which it reduces your cast time on your Immolate and your Shadow Bolt. We're not casting Shadow Bolt, but you do cast Immolate. I really wish they would put Incinerate into this. That would be really nice. And then put one in Shadow Burn, which is the only for sure one. Now, this last one is up for contention as well. Some people like to put it in Improved Corruption and keep Corruption up the whole time, uh, which is fine. Corruption does good damage, and it makes it instant. And some people like to put up Improved Imp, and then improve firebolt for your imp but he dies kind of frequently and succubus does way too much damage not to use succubus so what i suggest is devastate now at first on paper it just seems like corruption will do more damage but the problem is corruption costs 100 mana which is a chunk of mana for you to keep up every 18 seconds i personally dislike the devastation mixed with demonic tactics and you just full pump and just watch the crits happen or at least hope they happen um, but that's up to you if you don't want to run this and you want to run the five and improve corruption or even the pet that's completely up to you for suppression don't worry about it because this does not help out your destruction spells all right guys that's it for this one i'll see you on the next one have fun out there pump some numbers get some loot peace